Well, the trick or treat bags are ready to be filled with candy this Halloween, but it's always safety first. Fox 2's Taylor Harris talks with the American Red Cross Association on how you and your family can stay safe this Halloween. It is that time of year where ghosts and goblins take the streets and children are running door to door to fill their buckets with candy. It is important to make sure that safety is priority, especially when families are trick or treating this holiday season. Trick or treat. The American Red Cross is providing some tips for families to follow during fall and Halloween activities. We just want to remind parents to keep a close eye on their children and especially this time of year as it starts to get dark early. We also want to keep in mind the fact that people need to be able to see children after dark, so try to put something on them that's reflective. Parents should pack hand sanitizer and make sure children are sanitizing their hands frequently to prevent the spread of COVID and the flu. It's also important to avoid walking in the street and stay on the sidewalk when possible. So if you do have to be in the street, make sure you're as far over as possible and facing traffic when you're walking. And that way the cars can see you and you have an opportunity to be farther away from them or to get away from them. Make sure that you're considerate of others when trick or treating. Only visit homes with a porch light on and accept treats at the door. Never leave children unattended. Have a parent or responsible adult present, especially with younger children. After attending Halloween activities, an adult should check all candy before children indulge it. Make sure that the wrappers are all consistent with how they would look if they were in the store and you purchased them new. Make sure nothing has been tampered with and just be careful with any items where something could be tampered with. So if you're, they're getting something like an apple that could have something inserted in it. Following these simple steps can ensure that you and your family will have a safe trick-or-treating experience. Reporting in St. Charles, Taylor Harris, Fox 2 News.